Welcome back, gentlemen. Today I have an interesting video here from this Instagram page that I follow called Red Pill Co. <laughs> and this video, this video has been going viral through all of social media of this girl essentially shaming incels. And while I do believe incels should be to a certain extent and shamed and criticized because that's what's going to make them better. You need to do. Watch how this plays out. Just, just watch. Just watch. It's interesting. <laughs> Can you explain what an incel is? So an incel is just like someone who is involuntarily celibate. That okay. loser sitting Fair. on Reddit for 23 hours a, a day um, with cheetah dust and empty Mountain Dew cans all around them. And it just has a real stank smell that is involved with these people. Perfect. Because I'm just going to paint you an image. And like the fedora is a yeah. little crusty. And the the beard, the, the neck beard is strong. But the facial hair is weak. And there's a bald spot in the back. And you can just, and you can just see the fedora just hanging on for dear life. And he's sitting there mutter, muttering under his breath about how like Jessica Alba's uh, ugly. Right. You know, Literally, like yeah. that's what you're talking about. <laughs> Can you explain what Bro, I'm sorry, man. Like, how do you have this level of resentment towards man? Nothing she said was wrong, by the way. I'm not going to say she's wrong. But it's like, look in the mirror, bro. Like, look in the mirror. So There's no way you're saying this. There's no way, bro. She literally looks like the shorty from I Want a Sodies. I want my sody pops. You ever watch that video? You ever watch that video? Hold up, I'll, I'll pull it up right now. I'll put it up right now. Sodies. <laughs> Do you drink water? <laughs> Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I can be a little. Crap, 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 crap. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up. I want to see the sodies right here. Do you drink water during no. the day? No water at all. All right, and then what are you drinking during the day? Sodies. Bruh. Sodies. Sodies. <laughs> <laughs> Sody pops. Okay. Sody pops. I got me. I got me. And how much do you think you drink a day? <laughs> Eight to twelve a day. Hey yo, what the fuck? Eight to twelve cans. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm sorry. Like, how do you pass this level of truthful judgment? I'm not even gonna say it's not true. But you don't look at yourself, man. Like, come on, you gotta look, bro. Like, this is extreme. Is just like someone who is involuntarily celibate. This is extreme. And the girl on the other end of the podcast is just like, you know, I'm not gonna say nothing. I'm gonna be a nice little dandelion, nice little flower. Like no fat shaming, but incel shaming is fine, right? Like she 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 went hard on the incels, which I'm not saying go go soft on them. But it's like, yo, like if you're gonna do that, also. Take some shots at yourself. Like, all the things that you crapped on them about, you need to self-improve on as well. That loser sitting on Reddit for 23 hours a day um, with Cheeto dust and empty Mountain Dew cans all around them. Cheeto dust and empty Mountain Dew cans. So how do you get to this level if it's not for Cheetos and Mountain Dew? How? There's no, there's no way you're getting there without them Cheetos and Mountain Dew too. All right, so maybe she's talking from experience. Maybe, maybe I'm just bugging. Um, and it just has a real stank smell that is involved with these people. Perfect. Because it has to be experience, man. It has to be experience. Let's see what the people are saying, right? They're saying uh, her heart and that chair are hanging on for dear life. God damn. Fit in the screen first and then talk. Drop her on his own. Oh, my God, bro. That's bad. Breathe air. That was bad. She single handle. She single. Ha she's single handling created food shortages in the region. Okay. <laughs> yo, this is bad. Uh, yo, this is the final Gorlock destroyer boss. God damn. Strongest chair ever made. I just know she tried her best not to eat the mic. God damn. And they got fat bastard. Oh my god. <laughs> She talks like she be she's because she still gets smashed on the regular. And you know what the craziest part is? I can't even disagree with this comment because 
I've seen videos of guys making fake TikTok accounts. Let me see if I can find them. Fake TikTok account of a girl. Let's see. Fake Tinder account of fat girl. Crazy results. Who gets? All right. So look at this. Look at this. Look at this video right here. This is the first one that popped up. Tinder experiment, Chad versus obese woman, right? So, so like, this is not even crazy. This is not even wrong. matches on Tinder, the most attractive man or the least attractive girl. So we decided to do a little Tinder experiment. Here we used photos of a male model, take a look, clearly good looking guy. And here is a girl who's clearly not so good looking. So we wanted to see which one of these- And she, she weighs less than this, bro. Or like about the same. We got more Tinder matches. The male model got 112 likes in 24 hours. Pretty good. Let's compare it to the not so attractive girl. She got 474 likes. Bro, 474 likes, bro. What the hell is even that? Compared to the Giga Chat that had to sit here and look up self improvement videos. How do I line up my beard right? Right? How do I like eat correctly? How do I go to the gym and actually stay stay involved in the gym? How do I involve myself in modeling so I can get good pictures like this? Dude had to bust his ass and Shorty does no type of self-improvement and gets four times the amount of viewership and likes and attention. In the same time span in the same city. So that Jeez. This is their plan, people. These are demons. So that comment's not too far off. That's really what I wanted to prove with that, right? Stop feeding her for a year. But if you're going to make comments like this, you got to take a good look in the mirror, right? You have to have shit in your own life check. I'm not saying she can't have her own opinion, but I would love it if she would just lose a bunch of weight after saying all that about incels, man. Like, because fem cells don't exist. Fem, fem cells do not exist. Why don't fem, fem cells exist? Because there's still girls like this that are able to get 474 likes in 24 hours on Tinder, right? There's still a guy out there desperate enough to sit here and want to clap these cheeks. You need to do what you're supposed to do. <laughs> That's, that, was the, that was the worst part. That was the worst part. Bumbaka! <laughs> God damn. So, hey man, this is the delusional world we're living in. It's women like this talking about insults in such a derogatory way instead of a, instead of a place from empathy empathy right they always want to say people always want to talk about men's mental health women don't have the answers and men should not be lis listening to women because they don't have the answers whether they're skinny they're beautiful they don't have the answers whether they're big and abrasive they don't have the answers they don't they don't right so the best thing is that if you're going to make, if you're going to pass judgment on somebody else, right? Always pass the judgment through yourself first. Even if you're not doing it, just know, hey, here are the consequences because I passed on judgment to somebody else. I also need to take that sword and point it at myself. If you are living a virtuous life, then it shouldn't bother you. If you're not, then you know where you need to change. Don't forget, don't forget guys. If I provided you with any sort of value, entertainment, right, or something that you could actually apply to your life, drop a like on the video, all right, or subscribe. Jesus.